Hello friends, this video on hydrogen part 24 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Let's learn heavy water, D2O. What is D2O, heavy water? It is nothing but it's oxide of heavy hydrogen. We have seen there are three isotopes of hydrogen, right? So one is H, one is D, one is T. H, D and T. This is deuterium. So this oxide of deuterium is heavy water, that is D2O, right? And also called deuterium oxide. And it is discovered by Urey. It is very extensively used as moderator in nuclear reactors. You must have studied this nuclear fission and fission reaction in physics. There you have seen this D2O is used as moderator to control the speed of the um, particles, right, which are involved in the nuclear reactions. And it is prepared by prolonged hydrolysis or electrolysis of water. It is also pro uh, produced by some byproducts in some fertilizer industries. So generally it is prepared by prolonged electrolysis of water. Now we will see how this DTO is prepared. It is prepared by the prolonged electrolysis of ordinary water. It is also prepared by a fractional distillation of ordinary water. In case of fractional distillation, uh, the boiling point of H2O and D2O are different that is used. So for H2, the boiling point is 373.2 Kelvin and for D2O, the boiling point is 374.3 Kelvin. Though so there is a small difference, but there is a difference and we take advantage of this difference in boiling point and we do fractional distillation of the uh, ordinary water to get D2O. And it is uh, it, uh, retrieved in a very small quantity because the percentage of D2O in normal ordinary water is very less. So during complex uh, fractional distillation, we generate D2O. So we'll talk about the physical property of this uh, D2O. It is colorless, tasteless and odorless liquid, just like water. Its physical property is, similar, is, is almost similar to water. It's almost similar to water. We we'll talk about uh, chemical property that is also similar to water, but the reaction is slower. It's a little slow. If you see the chemical reactions, instead of H2O, we assume D2O, CaC2 plus D2O is called C2D2 plus CaO2. Similarly, SO3 plus D2O is D2SO4, Al4C3 plus D2O is CD4. So almost similar to all water but the rate of reaction is little slow. We will talk about the uses of D2O. So it is used for neutral moiety I told in the case of nuclear reaction it is used to moderate the speed of the particles involved in the nuclear reaction. It is used to prepare deuterium the D as I told the deuterium D it is used to prepare that and it is also used as a tracer compound. We must have, uh, if you have watched that equilibrium chapter, there we have told that we, we went to find whether the equilibrium is dynamic or not, right? So to, to confirm the equilibrium is dynamic, we use the uh, D2O actually. And there we told that we have this uh, D2O, H2O, all this compound mix. And after some time we found that we have uh, different uh, varieties of compound, right? So we, we used H and D combined together to find the equilibrium, uh, to prove that the equilibrium is dynamic in nature. So it is used for tracing. This is the tracing compound. We'll take some examples. Uh, knowing the properties of H2O and D2O, do you think D2O can be used for drinking? No. D2O can't be used for drinking purpose because uh, it slows the reaction and it is harmful actually. If it consumed a lot, it is not good for health. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors, and much more. Thanks once again.